welcome back to my channel. Thank you so, so much for watching. So today I have a Trader Joe's haul for you guys, and it's a pretty big one, I'd say. I will admit the last few weeks we've gotten kind of lazy, eaten way too much like takeout, but it's just kind of what happens every now and then. I like to think we do pretty good, but sometimes we're only human. And so anyway, this haul, we really wanted to like just stock up again and set ourselves up to eat at home, eat good all that so I thought I would share this haul with you guys also before this haul goes up on my last vlog which would be yesterday if you're watching this the day it comes out I do have um, a thrive haul you can see the big old box there and so that's also something that we have as well as all this so we're pretty stocked up now my kiddo goes back to school so I kept that in mind too of wanting to get some snack items to pack for him of course but yeah so Let's get into it. I hope you guys enjoy this haul. Please give it a thumbs up if you do. I greatly appreciate it. And I will put the prices with everything for you guys. And that Real is quick, that. Just like give you a little glance, but again, that video will be up before this of Thrive. I will link everything below too if you wanna check out Thrive. I absolutely love it. Everything is like healthy options. It's awesome. It's so great. And even this look, guys, come on now, vegan. Cheese its I'm into it. <laughs> and, but yeah, I have my link below where you can get 25% off as well as free shipping and a 30 day free trial. So that'll be linked below, but let's get into the old Trader Joe's. Now real quick, you can see, I kind of just have stuff like completely at random. So we're just gonna go for it. So the first thing I got was this gnocchi. These are so good. I like it just paired with like a marinara type sauce. Delicious, really quick and easy meal. If you've never had them before, they're like little potato like dumplings. They're really, really good, really good. I got two things of this tandoori naan. This is what Nate loves. He likes to take this to work and some hummus, which I got too and I'll show you in a minute. But I got two packages of that. I picked up one of these Light Life Smart Dogs. They're like the veggie, vegan um, hot dogs. I actually had a coupon for free for these, but I wanna say off the top of my head they're $2.99. So I got those. My kiddo really likes these, so that's cool just to have on hand, quick meal. I did pick up one of these spicy lentil wraps. They're really, really good, you guys. So, so good and vegan. And they normally have these right next to um, the falafel wraps and they actually did not have them this time which was kind of a letdown because that's what Nate really wanted so he actually got back to our uh, original we always used to get these the veggie wraps with hummus they're really good as well he wanted one for now and then to take to work too today just because we're kind of running short on time but other than that we pretty much got all foods that we can you know make here at home but I think I'm gonna have this for like lunch or dinner tonight as well and then I also picked up these uh, sliced apples and they're already like pre-done. My kiddo saw them, he said he wanted them and I was like, look, I'm not gonna say no to apples. So I uh, got those and we can like package those up for uh, him to take to school. Got a few things for the freezer just to have on hand for the, again, those lazier nights, but still to have something at home and still a little bit better. But I got these potato fries and we'll just, you know, do them in our air fryer or the oven just really quick and easy. They do carry like a garlic herb, um, french fry blend you can get. And honestly guys, it sounds amazing and it should be, but guys, they're not good. They're really not good at all. And actually a lot of you, when I did purchase it a few months ago, said the same thing. You were not a fan and I don't know what it is, but they are not good. But the regular ones are totally fine. And got some tater tots too to have um, on hand. We love these, these are so good. <laughs> Not the best thing for you, but delicious. And got some of these peanut butter filled pretzels. I really like to have just like a handful of these too. They're really filling because they do have peanut butter in them. And again, my husband likes to take those to work. Got four cans of sliced olives. And then I wanted to show you guys, this has been like circulating the last few months that Trader Joe's is now carrying the Lenny and Larry's Complete Cookie. And ours had not had them in the last like month or so and I finally saw that they had them there. Now they only have this one flavor, just the double chocolate, which is totally good, um, but they don't have like every flavor that you can find sometimes like at Sprouts has a lot more variety. 
but I will say too, it's kind of nice about these is they're smaller. Usually the ones you get at the like Sprouts, um, they're huge and they're actually like a serving size of two, but it's still one big cookie. Well, this is one serving and it's much smaller. So I thought that was kind of cool too. And just to have again on hand, I mean, it's a cookie, but really it's kind of a meal replacer because it is just loaded. It's kind of crazy. Um, yeah, 200 calories, seven grams of fat, eight grams of protein, five fiber. It's, it's pretty cool. And like all that stuff on there too. It's crazy. So got some of those. So they are finally here. Got some frozen edamame. I love just taking like little handfuls of this and throwing it on onto salads i love edamame it's delicious <laughs> and these are already shelled i got a thing of peanut butter i love their peanut butter um we're almost out and i needed to restock got some dried cranberries and um, my kiddo loves these in oatmeal which i think he just sneezed <laughs> but uh we got those for him sometimes he'll just have these like as a snack too but loves it in oatmeal Got some of these chocolate chips again. We've been kind of going through these. The last time I got them, I said they're gonna last us like a long time. And now we've kind of all been on a kick of adding a few to like oatmeal too. So, so good. And the chocolate chips there are vegan. The chocolate chunks are not. So just to kind of throw that out there for you, but vegan. <laughs> got some of these sun-dried tomatoes. These are really, really good, you guys, um, on salads, but also on pizza, which we got too, like crust for. So I'll show you that in a second too, but that was my uh, mindset of getting that. I actually already have uh, coconut sugar in my pantry, but I wanted to pick this up for my mom. She always makes like um, pancakes for my kiddo to like freeze and have in the morning and my kid loves them but we're gonna try substituting even keeping like her same recipe but uh just substituting like this sugar versus like regular cane sugar just to be a little bit better so got that for her and if you never had coconut sugar it's a great sugar replacement but it definitely isn't as sweet so if you're kind of transitioning maybe even start by doing like half and half even you know and kind of getting acquiring that taste I did get some more of these quick cuts, quick cooking steel cut oats. They're like ready to go in eight minutes. Traditionally, you know, steel cut oats, they can take like 30 minutes or more. Um, and these are perfect. They really do take like, I would say five to seven, maybe eight minutes. And I like these a lot. And then we got a bunch of greens here. And so I got one bag of baby lettuce, two bags of this butter lettuce and radicchio. I love this blend, it's so good two bags of spinach and one thing of romaine hearts. We do still have a little bit of lettuce in our fridge, so that's why I only got one bag of that, but just to kind of stock up on the greens. Got a thing of these veggie sticks uh, for the kiddo for school, and I'm just gonna put them into like little individual containers for him, kind of divide them up. Got a thing of asparagus. And then again, they have these like the teeny tiny avocados. I love these because they're just like a good size. They really are for like a meal and they're not too big. I like them. I don't know. And you get six of them. They definitely need to ripen up a little bit though. Got these sesame sticks. We love these on salads too, especially like a, a Thai type salad, like a peanut dressing. Oh yeah. Very, very good. Try these out. A lot of the times places will have these, but they'll have honey added to them, which, you know, if you're not vegan, not a big deal, but if you are, then they're not vegan, um, but these ones don't, so we'd love to get those. I got some more cashews, just raw cashews. Um, we use that a lot to make sauces or just to have. I haven't gotten this in a while and I wanted to just have it again, whether I'm using it as a dip or even like to put like onto tortillas to make a wrap. I have like a variety, but I love this. It's a little like hummus quartet and you get roasted garlic hummus, regular tomato basil and spicy. Good stuff. I like this and it's a good price. Got some of these sweet potato ribbons and we love to get these to make our own sushi. They're perfect for that because they're so thin and we've even like eaten these like raw not that you would normally do that with potato but because they're so thin 
kind of works. <laughs> it's okay. But you can totally heat these through even just in hot water because they're so thin. Um, but we really like these a lot. Got some corn on the cob just to put on to salads or to have with a meal too. We love this corn on the cob there. It's so good. And it's all ready to go for you. Love it. Um, got two things of almond milk. We got the vanilla unsweetened. We love that there. We kind of like just go through either getting uh, Trader Joe's almond milk or Costco, wherever we end up at. We like both. So this time it was Trader Joe's. <laughs> and these are a half gallon. Did get two big things of hummus too. Now these are what like my husband likes to take with that non bread to work. He'll just take one of these and leave it there and just kind of replenish his stock. And whether he takes veggies, the bread, whatever it is, um, he likes to just have that on hand. So got those for him to take. Picked up their pizza sauce, which I absolutely love. This is for sure a favorite. We use it as pizza sauce, but also just a sauce with like noodles. It's good, I love it. And we got the uh, dough again. We've gotten this a lot now and we really enjoy it. It's the garlic and herb pizza dough. We picked up a thing of plums. We've been on a plum kick lately. They're so sweet and so good. And saw that they had a big old bag of them there, so got those. I just wanted to get a couple uh, limes and lemons. Got two purple onion and one little package of raspberries. I love raspberries on oatmeal. I love it. Raspberries with a little bit of those chocolate chips. Oh yeah. So good. <laughs> and then I also got um, a thing of uh, zucchini and this came with three of them. Now our garden has a couple on there almost ready to go too. So I kept that in mind of not getting like too much. And I really wanted to try these out guys because these are actually on Thrive Market but you have to get kind of like a big box of them there. And I'm okay with doing that, but I wanted to try them first before I committed. So I totally saw these on Thrive and thought about it. And then when I saw them at Trader Joe's individually, I'm like, yes, I wanna try these out. But these are both vegan. Um, one is a sunflower butter and chocolate, and then one's a peanut butter chocolate chip. And I've heard Kate Flowers, who's like a raw vegan, or at least mostly, talk about these before i'm pretty sure she was the one and she really liked these so i wanted to try these out let me know if you tried these and what you think but kind of nice little again just out the door meal replacers high protein um let's see here 290 calories i mean these are pretty loaded um but 11 grams of protein two fiber which isn't really that much but i don't know just thought i would try these out got a big thing of cherries they had right when you walked in and i'm like yes we love cherries so good and some things of bananas just to have it's cooling down at least a little bit right now because we've been having a heck of a time like keeping things from getting too ripe too fast because it's just so hot um even with our air on and stuff but hopefully we're through the worst of it <laughs> and i also got this big thing of organic strawberries they have been so good this year from trader joe's they really have and i got a thing of coffee just to have on hand sometimes i use like the little k cups and sometimes we like to use the ground coffee too we want to start making like bigger batches just to have like over ice and then I also picked up a thing of their vegetable broth, the low sodium one. I love having this on hand because I use this a lot in lieu of uh, oil just to like, you know, make sure things don't stick to the pan. Um, veggie broth, it's a, it works perfectly. But I think, oh no, hold on. I put it in the freezer. All right, so I just pulled it out of the freezer. I just wanted to make sure that it didn't melt too much. We got this a few weeks ago and we absolutely loved it. And all of you who have tried it said it's amazing too. And you're so right, delicious. Even if you're not vegan or dairy free, please try this out. It is so good. The soy creamy non-dairy frozen dessert cherry chocolate chip, yum. And then we did get the vanilla one to try too. We haven't tried this one yet. So got those. And I think that is it. So I will put the total here for you guys. I feel like we're finally like stocked up again. We kind of fell off, like I said, for a little while of just getting spoiled, eaten out, and that's not good in, in excess, you know? <laughs> so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Be sure to check out the Thrive Haul that I had up before this if you'd like. And I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope you have a great day and I will see you guys very, very soon. Mm -hmm.